Well, good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, I'm wearing camo from head to toe. And that means one thing. It's turkey season, but it's only archery season here in Kansas right now. My buddy Levi's got a tag and a bow, and he's wanting to shoot one with his bow. So, we're gonna go out and try to shoot a turkey this morning. Levi said that he's got a pretty good idea where these turkeys are coming from and going to, so uh, we're gonna head over to his house, go get set up, and hopefully see some turkeys this morning. We're a little behind, but that's all right. What's the word? It's gonna happen today? Hopefully we'll hear a gobble at two. It's gonna happen, hopefully. Turkey season's a blast. It's just, it's warm, and the birds are t active, and it's just, you can't describe turkey season, you know? Yeah. <laughs> We're running a little bit behind this morning, but I think it'll be okay. You guys hear the birds chirping? I think I think that's a good sign. All right. Well, we're off. First turkey hunt of the year. We haven't scouted them. We haven't done anything. But we're gonna go give it a shot. Okay, we're hearing some gobbles, which is always a good sign. We got gobbles in that direction. We got gobbles in that direction. Gotta get the blind set up, and hopefully they're still on the roost. Yeah, I think they are. I think uh, as the uh, morning goes on a little bit more too, they'll get a little more active. It's a clear morning. We're gonna have sunny skies. Okay, we're all set up, and we're hearing a lot of gobbles. We got gobbles over there, and we got gobbles over there, and we got some gobbles over there. We're surrounded by some turkeys. Hopefully, we're smart enough to trick these guys today. They're talking this morning, though. They're still on the roost, so they haven't come down yet. Hopefully, we're in the middle of this uh, triangle, this love triangle of, of toms. We had a bearded hen come out. And all 
these gobblers are on the other side of the trees behind us, and it sounds like they're just going in circles around each other. I'm confident that we'll get a turkey. It sounds promising. We just need them to cooperate. But they are really talkative today. Turkey number two. It's another hand. Waiting on the boyfriends at this point. This one came from a different direction, though. It came from over there. We can't really see over this hill. So there could be one right on the other side of the hill, slipping in quiet. The ones behind us are still gobbling like crazy. They've been they've been at it for like an hour, hour and a half, and they haven't moved. They've just been walking around through. They finally came out. Four of them. There's four. And then another one came from across the field. Um, I think Levi rushed his shot a little bit. Uh, yeah, we, uh, we thought they were going to come out from this direction. And they came out from that direction. So... Uh, and when they came out, they were they were not walking real fast, but fast enough that Josh had to move, get out of the way, and I had to readjust. Of course, I'm on my knees anyways. I forgot a chair. You always forget something. It's always something. Yeah, I think that was a clean miss. But it's hunting. Archery season's tough. It was shotgun season. We would have both shot a turkey. For sure. Yeah. Yeah. 110%. I've, I've had the most terrible luck with a bow. I've had a turkey at 8 yards, 10 yards, 15 yards. Shootable turkey. In range. And I think I missed two last year. And... Well, my first shot this year I missed, so just par for the course for me. I mean, I just can't shoot a turkey to save my life, but... Hey, good news is there's plenty of season left. Yeah. It's no fun to tag out on your first time out. Right. Oh. And we saw, and we seen four toms this morning. Yeah, so we, four toms. So I think we, setting up in that the, field down there. The, the, the one that I shot at, the beard on it, was dragging the ground. Because I, I saw those, those first two out. I looked at those and I saw that last one come out and God, he was dragging a 15 inch rope on his, on his chin, so put it on him, but I don't know, I missed, I guess. We'll go back and look at the video, see how bad I missed. Well, found the arrow. Yeah. Bad arrow, I guess, I don't know. <laughs> Upon reviewing the footage, this turkeys might have been a little bit far. Would you say? Yeah. They might have been a little farther out than we thought they were going to be, but there's turkey tracks. Everywhere. Yeah. I don't know. We yeah. should if we set up 20 yards down, 10 10 yards down, yeah. we would have been able to see everything that was going on behind us this morning, and. Uh, I think if we had the decoys over here, they would have, because the blind is right there. We'll put the decoys here. 
the turkeys were all out in this field here. So I think that would have helped if they were able to see the decoys because there's a whole line of trees behind us where we set up. So. Who knows? I'm glad they showed up though. Yeah, they were behind us the whole time. I mean, yeah. For and an you, hour and a half, they stood back there and gobbled. Oh, they were gobbling like crazy. But, you know, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. And I think that was probably going to be the best opportunity we were going to get. Yeah. That was it. Uh, once, they, once they came out, and I think they saw... I was trying to close the uh, one of the windows on the blind. Well, I'd say if it was shotgun season and we both had shotguns and we both had tags, we'd both be tagged out today. Um, bow hunting's just pretty rough sometimes. Yeah. Being patient's pretty rough too. Yep. I think they busted us right when they came oh. through the trees because you were messing with the blind right at the wrong moment. Yeah. Um, but turkeys live to see another day. Didn't injure a turkey and have it walk off. So, you know, it all worked out. And we got plenty of season left. Got any final remarks, Levi? We'll try it again sometime. Yeah, we'll get them again. I mean, you can't always be perfect. You can't always be perfect. I mean, who wants to end their who wants to end their season on the first day, or you know, the first day you go hunting? Who wants to shoot their turkey within the first hour? That's not any fun. I mean, we got to stimulate the economy. We got to spend money. I mean. Stop and get breakfast every morning at the gas. Well, I guess we're not doing that right now because it's the virus, but I mean, you know, eventually we'll be able to stop and get get breakfast and drinks and soda and pop and snacks and, and uh, you know, do all that fun stuff again. But uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll try and get them and uh, hopefully put a nice one on the ground this weekend or soon before before everybody else gets out there gets after him but I think I better go home and practice that's that's what I that's probably what I should put on my calendar for the rest of the day is go home and practice because you can't hit them with a crossbow but it's, it's like cheating is what they say so I'm not very good at it if you guys liked today's video leave it a thumbs up if you want this hat there's a link in the description you can head over to the website and pick it up if you guys want to follow me on my social media i've got twitter instagram snapchat and facebook so follow me on there and stay up to date with what's going on but that spit it out junior <laughs> but that is all i've got for you guys today i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you on the next one